Okay, so I think we're back in. Let's see where it saved us. Probably from the top of the roof, start of the roof. There's our ticket out of here. To be looking at we can get to it. They more for luck. Coming to you, Simmons. I'm sure they saved the room for you in hell. He's blocking the exit. Let's do something about it. Yo, hide in the hide in the left far left side. I think I don't think he spears you there. You're finally gonna get what's coming to you, Simmons. Yeah. I'm sure they saved a room for you in hell. <laughs> Let's do something about it. <laughs> I just shot him once in the chest. Now, go! Yeah, we just have to shoot him a bunch and then wait a minute. Or kill all the zombies. No, the zombies keep the spawn. That's what we thought last time. Ah, uh, I know there's a big alarm on this time. Uh, there must be some random. We've got to get to that helicopter. <laughs> You're just standing there. And the sooner the better. Yeah, he just 
just like throw a big piece of himself at us or something? I'm alright. Or uh, one here. of the zombies like clusters into each other. Wait, play rough, huh? Okay. I missed that about We gotta get to the helicopter! Stuff in crates. Smashing crates is so satisfying, it's one of the things that made Half-Life better. Making juice out of them. Oh, yeah. Hey. Oh, right, we need to ground this asshole. EDM, as yeah. long as he's airborne, we're not going anywhere in that chopper. I'll be damned if I'm going to let him stop us. Okay, we wait. He's trying to protect his head. We're going to get a shot. Well, I would assume first is the heat source. Go for his legs! 
happen. If we damage him enough, he wants to rebuild himself, so he, he grabs on that, his zombies with the lock, and then he gets the electric key. We gotta make sure he gets lightning rod. Yep. Okay, how do we make sure he gets lightning rod? Uh, uh, if you see a random one like that, you stick it into his dump. Uh. Oh, you gotta stick it Okay, this one is ready. <laughs> Jeez, horrible. Kingdom awaits, my lord. Camera is fucking awful right now. Yeah, that would make so much sense to me. Oh, crap. <laughs> uh -oh. 
Oh no. No. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I recall that I recall like having an RPG at this point. This is insane. Yeah. This is bad. We gotta get to the helicopter. <laughs> I could be remembering it wrong. I don't know. Like I'm gonna Rubik's Cube the Shadow and Zombie. Alright, we need to ground this asshole. As long as he's airborne, we're not going anywhere in that chopper. Go for his leg! If he absorbs that, he'd be in for a shot. Good for her arm, guys. <laughs> oh, shit.
Got a brush out here. I'm okay. Gotcha, you bastard! And swearing the chopper. This floor is stable. Okay. Swearing, I guess this, you know, years ago they wouldn't say this stuff. Yeah, I don't know, it's like, it was, it was Resident Evil 5 when they started saying, oh. like, just because. Uh, I think Chris tells Wesker I'm sick and tired of your bullshit. Uh, they, I think they said shit, like, in Resident Evil 4 too. Oh, hey, RPG I'm not sure. Ah, but, there we go. You know, but the F4 is another thing entirely, as far as the series goes. Let's go give a big round of applause to the captain who hit an iceberg oh, on the fucking Titanic. <laughs> like, seriously, we really should think of parking more. This should be standard kit. Go. I'm disappointed we didn't fire our pieces And then it's died for them, but I like skinny. <laughs> a lot of blood in him. He's made of the stuff. Well, surely, uh, this couldn't have any sort of implications here, could it? Dun dun dun. And it took a long time to die. That's for my sister. Come on. Let's get to the chopper. Yeah. All you right. messed with me, Let's I'll get turn out of you here. into a giant fly and then blow you up. I guess it was Ada that turned him into the giant fly. It was uh, Diet Pepsi Ada, actually. <laughs> but one of them. Is that Ada's? It's her birth control case. Oh no, just makeup. <laughs> In the Resident Evil universe, they're VD cards, not SD cards. Leon, this is... Evidence that proves Simmons' guilt. Which means it will prove your innocence. Our innocence. I don't need it. Heine. Good news, Leon. We found a way to defeat the virus. Yeah, maybe we should Copy that. We're on our way back. See you okay. soon. Let's go. Eyes on the air. Don't remember this scene from Terminator 2.
yes. Does this mean we get credits every single time we get the campaign? Uh, I guess they're kind of, the one that you have it is like each campaign is kind of its own game. Nowadays, they could have released like each campaign as a separate game, you know? You know, I kind of wonder if they like plan to do so at some point, but like, they could have to it. Like they were just going to charge you 30 bucks for it or something like that. That would have been nuts. The sad thing is, people probably would have paid for it. Some people. Well, people would have paid for the first one and then not the others. <laughs> That's what would have happened. Yeah. Storytelling is just so messed up. Like, yeah, I'm sure it's a bad, dumb story, just like Resident Evil 5, probably. But it's so incoherent, told this way, that that I don't know what's going on and I kind of don't care. <laughs> uh, they're trying to have a similar thing to Resident Evil 2 where you get the story from different angles, but I mean, that was different angles in the city. This is different angles across the world. And, and temporarily and everything. And we're just like, you know, we, we landed China and we're just like, Hey guys, what, what's up? You, you guys are cool. We're fighting a monster together. And he's like, yeah, it's the Ustanak, you know, or whatever. It's like, what? Huh? I don't care. Ada keeps showing up. So this, this was the head of its time anyway, because, I mean, that's what films are like nowadays anyway. They just assume that you know everything. So basically Resident Evil 6 predicted the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Yeah. <laughs> Just call it for that thing. Why? That's good. I think the background's okay, but this is not like great credits. Cinematic lighting. Hey, you don't want uncinematic lighting. Again though, I mean, some of the decisions here are very, very strange. Like, we want Simmons to be a Rubik's Cube zombie that becomes a giant fly that you have to beat with uh, with uh, lightning rod. Yeah, like, that wasn't set up anywhere. It's just like, oh, in this last battle, we're, we're doing a lightning rod thing. Okay, cool. Uh, Roy Baker is Jake? Uh, he's the motion capture Jake. Hey, if you can, if you can do both motion and voice, you know, that's well. Make the money. Dude, that guy gets around. I think, like, I think the annoying thing is just like how many uh, cinematics there are and how they're kind of long. I mean, they're not like Metal Gear long, but they're still too long. I mean, if you're gonna, you know, have front Simmons and then he's a crater and he turns into a monster. It should shouldn't take more than 20-30 seconds. You know, don't have them deliver all the serious dialogue. Who cares? The, I think some of the dialogue might have suffered from uh, translation. Like, well, you know, there's a, a place for you in hell. Yeah. Like the dialogue is always weird and bad and, and suffers from translation issues, but that's kind of okay if it's silly enough or feels silly enough and it's like you don't have to sit there watching and listening to it for very long. You know, the, the more... the briefer it is, the better. Uh, as long as you give the idea, I guess. Like, like oh yeah, remember that in the, on the left side? Remember that scene where we, you know, Chris and... Leon confront each other and it's like this supposed to be the super tense dramatic thing and it takes like two minutes or something it's like you know they're not going to shoot each other and the trailer that like before the game was out everybody's like oh why is why is Leon pointing a gun at Chris I always assumed that they were they were going to find out like one of them thinks the other is a zombie clone or something but no no it just turns out the funny thing is that 
the funny thing is that the Capcom had initially said 6 would be kind of a reboot, uh, it would be totally different, and that was bullshit, yeah. and it turns out yeah. that 7 is the reboot. Yeah, they, they gotta keep rebooting this thing. I mean, like, 4 was, was enough of a reboot, but then they just kept piling everything on, and bringing stuff back, and it's like, hey man, one of them is Wesker's kid, his clone kid, you know, from those reference in, like, some bullshit way back in Resident Evil 2 or something. It's like, does anyone care? Like, and Sherry Perkins uh, back from Resident Evil 2. Remember that's like, no. Who a shit? A Wesker not dying is something that I think they first brought up in Code Veronica X. Because uh, that's when, uh, that's when, like, you see Wesker come back. And also it has the, the cinematic about how he actually faked his death. Simmons is, is a, an idiot, I mean, like, you know, he transforms, like, how many times and he still can't kill us? And, I mean, all of this started because he he wanted, like, Ada to be his girlfriend? Yeah, what was that? I mean, you know, give Wesker credit, he's, like, you know, he, he's, he's kind of gay and he does that weird, you know, domination thing with brainwashed, uh, captured woman. Uh, you know, Jill and all, but he's not, you know, like, oh man, I'm a jilted ex-lover, or I got friend-zoned by, you know, her, and I totally want her back, and that's not her. It's like, no. He's, like, Wesker's just I tell you what, though, like, regular he evil. He starts an entire zombie outbreak. And mutates just because of a breakup. That's one of the messiest breakups I've ever seen. Yeah. It's like, oh, I, uh, I zombie in Shanghai and uh, Washington. Uh, I don't know. campus. Um, God, I. I know it's just, I think it was Metro City. Might be confusing with the Suicide Squad now. Yeah. These credits are really long, aren't they? The PC version, you'll notice nobody is from uh, Japan. <laughs> Yeah, oh, yeah. Polish sounding name. Yeah, mostly, yeah. Well, Jeez, I mean, look well, at that. For all its faults, it is a competent PC port. You know, I, I gotta give him credit for that. Yeah, it's solid. That's good. Why did we make Resident Evil 6? That's good. What the fuck? Keep going! Man, how many Every time you think it's no fun, I don't know how to get to your energy. nearly Ubisoft level uh, length of credits there. Jesus, did you see how many logos? <laughs> it's like 20, 20 something logos. 
Sony, Warner Brothers. We got like everybody on board for this. Yeah. Okay, so uh, you're going to tally up our, our score, Capcom. Wait, what's this? Oh, the, uh, the outro. Rest in peace, tentacle woman. It's time for me to take responsibility. My sister got turned into a tentacle monster, and then I had to kill her. It's all my fault. Those trees are Thank not you. looking good. I'm ready. assisted in the attack. No one knows that. The investigating commission have reviewed the evidence and feel it unjust to hold you liable for Simmons' crime. They will also not be disclosing their findings to the public. But Probably a smart thing. The president would have done the same. You know, I didn't even vote for that guy. The president would have infected himself and then helped right. Simmons. Shall we go join the team? Leon. For the next time you see her. Yeah, I really should return this to her, shouldn't I? Women. You know, Leon's only experience with women is Ada, so... Yeah. All that music, and then you get that giraffe logo. Women. Yes, you did get the end of chapter thing. Woohoo, gold. Gold, baby. The hell? All this because, oh, my accuracy and depth. Yeah, I guess my accuracy is higher because I didn't shoot as much. <laughs> Maybe yeah, it's the squad tower. Parted ways with Ada once again. I did not get the stealth attack on this. I like how they give you some for destroying an item box while sliding. Really? Yeah. Okay, so. I guess that was the end of the fifth chapter for Leon. And That's hello. Leon's campaign. Cool. Well, we'll pick up again next time with the next campaign. Whichever one we Chris. start with. Chris. Chris it is. And uh, I should probably have enough skill points to buy some skills before we start that one. Anyway, thanks for playing. Hey, it's cool. Uh, see you next time. Yep. Bye.